uh, I would love to hear a little bit about, um, you know, some of you talked a little bit about what inspired you on this project, but uh, either to get to create it, to get involved, or the or the idea itself. But I'd love to hear a little bit more in detail because I think that's always interesting to hear where the inspiration comes from, and then also how you how it comes to life. So maybe um, each of you can talk a little bit more about that. If you already talked about that then maybe going into a little bit more detail because the more the more you tell us about it, the better um so we'll start with demetra um so i'm born and raised in chicago so i had been living out in l.a for about three four years and i really missed the snow so that was a really big factor for me and i felt my inner child like come alive when we had the snow machine, like just snowing mm. while I was skating. And it was me kind of recreating a performance I had done at Millennium Park. It was an outdoor rink right next to the bean and it started snowing during my performance. So I basically like created this like snow globe effect of that moment in my life. Um, and yeah, we just wanted something that was uplifting and like really went tied in with the the winter theme and most people don't think about ice skating until like christmas time so that's why we decided to do like a christmas song that would yeah just be like hopeful cool and yeah yeah and um uh, i'd like to ask a follow-up question for you um what was it like actually being the 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 skater and director and uh, producer, on, you know, how were you able to juggle that on set, especially? So I majored in film and uh, I went to like Loyola University Chicago, which is like a smaller version of Loyola Marymount. So we had access to really good camera equipment and all of that, but we were kind of trained to be like a, a one man show. So I was used to wearing multiple hats, but it was my first time not holding the camera so to say and now being like in front of it so it was pretty it was pretty surreal and i, I almost challenging yeah i almost felt a little powerless and like a little less in control of the image but thankfully i had derek here and i was like does it look okay how, how is it and he's like trust me it's fine just you know we'll do like one more take for safety but you look great so it, it was just it was really cool to have full power of direction but again like a little bit intimidating and scary to but i'm a control freak what can i say like it was hard not seeing the image every time so yeah yeah well it's it's great that you're able to put so much trust in a very talented dp sitting next to you so that's fantastic 